Hi, my name is Hugo. Hi, my name is Olga. <laughs> we do lots of workshops, which include like literature, theater, and visual arts. I remember we went to the tea shop and like asked them some questions. We got to meet artists and hear about what they do. It was nice to have a space where we could let our imagination run wild and actually express that without being like judged or anything. It's not like any theater or place that I've ever been to. It's very individual. I know this place like it has soft chairs and it's in a little circle. It's very, it's very snug. Just like makes me feel at home. I like how there's like the little signs throughout the building. The art here is very unique, you know, there's lots of different types of art, so there can be like modern art and there can be like also like different styles. I think it's so important for as many people as possible to experience art and culture because it really shapes your, your views of the world and it shows you that everything can be art and everything can be a show and everything can be something if you just really think about it. I think it's a very good idea to have young people work with older artists because in a way it's like being encouraged by adults to like, I guess, harness your creativity is very important in young people because it helps you mature as a person. I think it's really important to reach as many children as possible because everything about what we do here, like as the ARC and like being listened to and giving children like the opportunity to experience all these things is really important. I know there's a lot of things here that I've been told at the ARC and taught at the ARC that are like, I wouldn't get that in school. I wouldn't get I wouldn't get any of this in school. There might be lots of kids who have never done any of the art, and so I think it gives them a chance to discover if they're really interested in it or not. I think the most important thing the art can do going into the future is, I mean, it already does this, but really listen to young people. Trying to get people to realise uh, things that they can do at home. Maybe start looking at building a new art place somewhere else and then you could get that kids in that area because some people might have a harder time traveling. Climate change is like very impacting the arts and the natural world to come together. It could be so amazing.